So in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up your Lenovo X1 without the Microsoft account. Microsoft account is mandatory in Windows 11, but can be skipped if you are tricky enough. And um, before we begin, first of all, if you haven't connected to internet yet, then don't. Um, if you already have, you'll need to walk away from your router or turn the router off if you can, so you just lose the connection. Once you know that you don't have connection to your internet, click on Shift and F10 key on your keyboard until this window pops up. If it didn't work, try pressing on Shift, Fn and F10. Fn key is uh, below the Shift on the bottom row of the keyboard. Mm. So once it's OK, uh, use your mouse to click on the top bar on the keyboard, uh, on the top bar of this black window that has shown up. And now I'm going to zoom it in for you. You'll need to type in OOBE backslash bypass and row and click on enter. Now it will restart your laptop and shortly uh, will be able to simply select the region again, select the keyboard layout again, and then we'll have a button to um, that will let us just uh, select. I don't have it in that because otherwise it just doesn't work. Um, I mean, you don't have the button to I don't have it in that. And once you click on it, you can just create your local account without the Microsoft account. Um, but you just can't connect to internet in order to, to be able to do that. Okay, and now I'm back in the setup process, so I'll need to just select the country or region, the keyboard layout as well. Click on yes, then I'm gonna skip a second keyboard layout. And um, click on I don't have it in that. Of course, um, later on after you create the local account, you'll, you can connect to internet because later on you can just use your computer. Even if it asks you to sign into Microsoft account, there always will be a skip button from now on. So let's type in a username that I want to create. Then also I highly recommend setting up a password. I'm not going to do that, but you can simply type in the password and uh, confirm it and then answer free security questions. Make sure you do that truthfully so you don't forget the answers to those questions because if you do, then if you forget your password, in, it will be unrecoverable and um, the only way to um, restore your laptop will be to actually install Windows again. So you probably don't want that. And now it'll start setting things up so you can simply uh, wait until it's done and I'm going to get back to you when it's done. And now it's all set up. Feel free to first of all connect to the internet now because it's quite important to have internet or on your computer, right? So I'm going to do that. And also feel free to go to Windows Update uh, in settings once you're connected to the internet because um, after setup you'll still most probably need to update some things because typically they get updated in the setup once you're connected to the internet but s since we, we weren't just go to settings then Windows Update then click on check for updates and you'll see everything here. And once it finds updates, just click on download and install all. And I hope that this video was helpful. Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you in the next one.